Well, hello, 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 everyone out there in tarot land. This is your girl, Zengaya, the Zen Libran, and welcome to my channel, Journeys with the Narcissist. Hey, y'all. I hope y'all doing good. I had to put this reading out, y'all, that I'm about to do. I did a um, reading on what happened with Takeoff, and um, I said, you know what? Let me check in on my boy. You know... My fellow starseed, my fellow Pleiadian, you know, my warrior. Let's check on my God, you know. Let's check on um, Rashad Jamal and do an energy update and see what's going on with him, you know. And when I pulled this out, I was like, man, that's why I was guided to do this reading. Because like I tell y'all ladies, women are narcissists too. I mean, it's an 80% men and 20% women. But when they bitches, they bitches. You know what I'm saying? And that's what my boy was dealing with, you know? The energy of this reading is um, <laughs> my God didn't have no feelings for this particular person. They had no passion for this person. Um, she probably couldn't even get his D on hard. You know what I'm saying? He had no passion uh, uh, moving forward with this particular person. Now, that's the energy of this reading for Jamal Rashad, Okay. All right, what's going on here, y'all? Okay, see, Jamal Rashad, he's very intuitive, okay? Very intuitive. Um, he's very strong also, you know what I'm saying? She tried to, this feminine that he was dealing with tried to tame him. <laughs> she tried to control him. She could because he was too strong, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, he left her ass. You know what I'm saying? She left him, he left her, or somebody left somebody, but um, I'm feeling the energy of he left her ass. You know what I'm saying? Because the energy of this reading is that he had no passion going to move forward with her. I mean, he didn't even have feelings for her anymore. You know what I'm saying? So he left her ass. You know what I'm saying? See, this particular individual is on some bullshit. She want to get him by herself. And just, like, attack him. Just put all the knives in his back. Just do him in. You know what I'm saying? And this is his child's mother. This is his child's mother. A cold-hearted bitch that ain't got no feelings. You know what I'm saying? She want to get this guy together. She want to get my guy by herself. You know what I'm saying? Get him by herself, y'all. You know, because she mad because he left her ass. You know, because she couldn't tame him because he's a strong brother. He's a he's a warrior. He's a god. You know what I'm saying? So she's like, yeah, let's get him by himself. You know what I'm saying? Away from his family and his friends. And then we can do him in. Yeah, this is what his baby mama did. Cold-blooded bitch. You know what I'm saying? Um, forget all about her child, that he is the father of her child. She just want to take him out of here. Not uh, realizing what his absence in his child's life would do to him. Would do to the child. I mean, you know what I'm saying? Um, she mad. She mad that he left her ass. <laughs> she mad cause he left her ass you know what I'm saying he left her and got married or in a commitment with somebody uh, you know they living together doing their thing his wife he left her ass and got married you know what I'm saying and now you know she's focused on him now she's very immature and she's focusing on him now cause she knows he's a star you know what I'm saying my boy is a star seed you know what I'm saying and she just want money she just want money you know what I'm saying? And um, she just want to just give him a hard time. She just want to, she's focused on damaging this, this, this guy. Because she couldn't control him, y'all. Because she couldn't tame him, I want to say. But you can't tame a God. That's chaos. You know what I'm saying? You can't, you can't control a God. I mean, what, what, what's the meaning of you? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, she wanted to be in a union with him. You know what I'm saying? But the divine is like, nope. You know what I'm saying? Um, get on out of here. You know what I'm saying? It's not going to happen. You know what I'm saying? He's already with somebody, and she mad. She mad because he left her, y'all. She mad because he left her. He left his baby mama and got in a union with somebody else. You know what I'm saying? She pissed. She pissed, y'all. She pissed, okay? Um, yeah. And her main focus is to hurt him. Her main focus was to do him in, so she want to get him by himself. You know what I'm saying? So she helping the people that's trying to constrain my brother. You know what I'm saying? Constrain my star seed because she, he left her ass. 
You know what I'm saying? And got a, got married with somebody else. She wanted to reconcile with him. But he wasn't messing with her. You know what I'm saying? Um, she wanted to emotionally manipulate him. So whatever he was with her, whatever commitment he was in with her, he was like, I'm gone. Uh, this commitment is over. You know what I'm saying? And she's pissed. She's pissed. You know what I'm saying? So now, you know, she in cahoots with these people that are trying to keep my, my God down. You know, trying to keep my God down, you know. But the universe is giving my God plenty of love. Plenty of love, his ancestors and spirit guys got his back. You know what I'm saying? They love him. You know what I'm saying? And this system is not going to control him. You understand what I'm saying? Not going to control him. You know, um, these people are narcissists, okay? And they know that he's a star. You know what I'm saying? He's, he's, he's a star. And they wish fulfillment was to control him, you know? But the universe, they can't control him because the universe is all around him, all, you know, got his back. You know, his ancestors, they don't play. They don't play. They don't play. And not to mention that he got this beautiful woman that he's over there married to and a commitment to. She's into her spirituality. You hear what I'm saying? And she's over there praying for him, talking to her ancestors and her spirit guides, you know, uh, because her man getting out of jail. He getting out of jail, y'all. He getting out of jail. You know what I'm saying? And he's fighting. You know what I'm saying? Um, he's um, moving forward, slowly progressing forward, you know, from the manipulation and him trying to defeat him and trying to win at all costs. You know what I'm saying? He's fighting ass. He's fighting to get out of jail. You know, his wife is fighting for him to get out of jail. And she's doing her little rituals and she's praying her ass off and I'm praying for him too, baby. You know what I'm saying? And you got to know that your prayers, they hitting. Because I know mine hit hard. Because I know what I possess inside me and I pray for him. You know what I'm saying? Um, but yeah, he getting out of jail, boo. He getting out of jail. So keep praying and doing your spirituality. You know what I'm saying? Keep fighting. Keep fighting. Yeah. These two are warriors. Look at her. She's passionate about it. She got the cat up there. You know, she ain't playing. She got a crystal. She ain't playing. You know what I'm saying? She a woman after my own heart. You hear what I'm saying? She ain't playing. And she'll draw that stick for her man. You know what I'm saying? See, that's what I'm talking about. See, you need a strong woman that's willing to take the reins when the man can't. And she's handling that biz. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Look at my God up here in attack mode on his throne fighting for his freedom and his happiness. Fighting for his freedom and his happiness. And he ain't apologizing for shit. And I don't blame him. I don't blame him. Okay? He ain't apologizing for fighting. You know what I'm saying? And the universe showing him love. Showing him love. He not taking no offer that nobody giving him. Okay? Because they trying to give him an offer. They trying to emotionally man manipulate him so they can celebrate. But it's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. You know, this corporation, this corporation or or these people with money, this system, they have their eye on him because they know he's a star. They got their eye on him because they know he's a star seed and he's here to uplift humanity. That's my bro. That's my God. You hear what I'm saying? You know, and these people are pissed because he's spiritual and they're religious. They're religious, just like his baby mama. She religious, too. You know what I'm saying? She ain't understand what was going on. You know what I'm saying? And she wondering why everything she was throwing at him and she couldn't control this guy because he's a God. You know what I'm saying? A religion, you can't do nothing with him. He's a God into his spirituality. You know what I'm saying? He left his hoe. He left her. Because she a cold-blooded, religious mofo. And she wanted to reconcile. That would have been her wish fulfillment. But he has a beautiful woman with him that has his back. You know what I'm saying? Look at these two warriors together. Look at that king. 
Look at that queen together. They doing battle. They fighting the system, y'all. Because the system knows. They know who we are. They know the star seeds. These are religious people. So you got the religious fighting against the spiritual. And that's a shame that his child's mother is working with these people, this organization, to damage this God because she couldn't, she couldn't constrain him. She couldn't bind him, and he left her ass. She couldn't tame him, you know, and she helping him. And that's a shame that you want to, you know, that's an evil person, y'all, that want to hurt this God when all he's trying to do is just uplift humanity. But keep, you know, hold on, bro. You know what I'm saying? You built for this. This is what we do. You hear what I'm saying? This is what we do, bro. This is what we do. We build for this. We fight battles all the time, and you get stronger and stronger. You know, I'm feeling this energy. I love this. He ain't apologizing for fighting for his freedom. And he's getting out of jail. He's getting out of jail, baby. He's getting out of jail. So his wife and you, Rashad Jamal, keep on fighting. The universe loves you, and they got your back. Don't take no offers that this freaking system is trying to give you, baby. Because they got you alone. And they're trying to cut your throat. They're trying to take you out of here. Yeah. They got you alone. Without your family and your friends. Yeah. And trying to damage you. With the help of your child's mother. Somebody he has a child with. Trying to hurt him. Trying to take her child's father out of his life. When she knows what he represents. She mad because he left her ass. She mad because she couldn't tame him and control him. He was too strong. He was too intuitive. She mad, y'all. She mad. Like I tell you, y'all, women are narcissists too. Women are narcissists too. And she's helping them. They focused on them. These religious people. Yeah. Yeah. They want to get them, y'all, so they can celebrate taking down another star seed. You know. They're trying to emotionally manipulate him and everything. Talking about his family. Don't you miss your family? I mean, you know, you know, giving him the business. But he ain't taking no offer they give him. He ain't taking no offer they give him. Do you feel me? That's that warrior. That's that warrior. Hold on. Keep your faith. Get your meditation in. You know what I'm saying? Watch them what you eat. You know what I'm saying? Because these people are narcissists, honey. And they want to control you, but they can't. Because you are a star. You are a star seed. You tapped in. You connected. You're on that upper level. So I send my, my love and light out to your wife, who you're in relationship with. Just hold on, baby. He coming. He coming. Keep doing your rituals. Keep on praying. Stay into your spirituality. Do what you got to do. Because he fighting for his freedom. And he ain't apologizing about it. Damn it. Tell you, women are narcissists too. Trying to take him out of here, y'all. All because he don't want her ass. He has no desire to move forward with her. No feelings for her. He got this pretty woman right here that's into her spirituality. This is what happens to these confused religious bitches. You know what I'm saying? They get material gain by trying to take down a star seed. Get him by himself. And we could do them in. Mm, mm, mm. She just don't know. She gonna reap what she sow. Because you can't hurt a chosen. Okay? This is one of the 144,000. This part of my soul tribe. You know what I'm saying? You gonna be free, baby. You getting out of jail. They can't hold you and control you. 
Okay? They can't manipulate you emotionally. They focused on you, though. They want to damage you, honey. Because you're so strong and they can't pacify you like they did your, your boy. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> they pacified him and look at him now. A damn fool, you know. But keep using your intuition. Stay tapped in, bro. Stay tapped in. You know? Keep being that husband and that father. Keep doing you, boo. Warrior status. We ain't playing out here in these streets. We playing for keeps. I love all y'all. And send out a prayer for my boy, Rashad Jamal. Keep your head up, God. Keep your head up.